Hi, and welcome to this video from HPE Storage Technical Marketing Engineering on StoreOne's Catalyst. This will be a quick introduction to the Catalyst feature that is so key to the impressive capabilities of the HPE StoreOne's appliance. This video is a companion piece to the white paper entitled HPE StoreOne's Catalyst, a Solution for Enhanced Data Protection, a link to which can be found at the end of this video. So let's get started learning all about Catalyst. So what exactly is Catalyst? Well, Catalyst is an HPE developed protocol that is specially designed to maximize backup performance using the StoreOne's disk-based data protection appliance. Most important reasons for using Catalyst as a backup target are simplicity. Catalyst is very simple to deploy with just a couple of clicks required to create a Catalyst store as a backup target and has an easy to navigate GUI. High performance. The Catalyst protocol works with StoreOne's deduplication to not only reduce the bandwidth required to backup data, but also reduce the time required to complete backup jobs. Flexibility and control. Catalyst allows users to do more than just create fast deduplicated backups. Catalyst Copy can create secondary copies of backups for off-site storage and works with cloud bank storage to be able to store backup data in the cloud. All of this is managed from within the user's data protection application for complete control of backups, replication, and cloud storage. Security. Catalyst offers encryption options that can be enabled with a simple click of a checkbox. Also, the Catalyst architecture protects users from ransomware or malware attacks by isolating backup data from operating system commands that could be compromised by hackers. Catalyst is supported by the most popular data protection applications on the market, such as Veritas Net Backup and Backup Exec, Veeam, Bridgehead, and Microfocus Data Protector. And for Oracle, SAP HANA, and Microsoft SQL Server admins, Catalyst offers plugins to allow the native backup tools for these databases to recognize Catalyst stores as backup targets. Now let's take a look at the architecture that makes up the Catalyst protocol. The centerpiece for Catalyst functionality is the Catalyst API. It acts as a translator between data protection app commands and Catalyst commands to allow the app to configure, schedule, and run jobs to Catalyst stores. By default, Catalyst uses low bandwidth deduplication, which has a good portion of the deduplication process take place on the backup server. This reduces the network bandwidth required to complete a backup job as only unique chunks of backup data need to be sent from the backup server to store once. Sending fewer chunks means that the backup takes less time to complete, making a dramatic improvement in job performance. Catalyst Copy allows users to create copies of these backup jobs on remote StoreOnce devices to satisfy disaster recovery requirements. These jobs are low bandwidth as well, improving performance and moving data off-site. Cloud Bank Storage uses Catalyst Copy technology to create backup copies in the cloud. Using object stores created at Amazon Web Services, Microsoft Azure, or in a Scality private cloud. All of these features fit perfectly with the industry standard 321 data protection principle that HPE highly endorses. 321 means three copies of your data on at least two different types of storage with at least one copy off site. Catalyst makes meeting this 321 principle fast, simple, and can make an enormous difference in a customer's data protection strategy. For a more detailed look at Catalyst and how it works, take a look at the white paper entitled HPE StoreOne's Catalyst, a Solution for Enhanced Data Protection, found at the link shown here. Thanks very much for watching.